Hi guys, Juliana here. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. If you noticed, I changed the uh, channel name to African Child because I feel like I need to do more on um, African, you know, like uh, deco, you know, stuff. Just take you guys along, show you some uh, nice uh, deco stuff that we have here in Kenya um, and hopefully in future in other places of uh, Africa. So I'll be taking you guys along, showing you different uh, people, make different uh, deco stuff here locally, just show you some uh, beautiful uh, places and stuff like that. So, so today's video is a very random one. Um, today is my day that I normally set aside to just refresh the room, you know, uh, to change uh, beddings and, you know, to just keep the bedroom looking neat. Uh, my cleaning lady already came and uh, did the general cleaning. She didn't want to be part of the video, so I'm just going to like do the remaining parts and uh, style the bed, you know, uh, and show you guys just a few tips on how you can keep your room uh, smelling fresh and looking nice. So welcome. I'll show you how the state of the room is right now, and then I'll take you along as I do the magic so welcome 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 <music> you know until you find the perfect position so I moved this mirror here and I love 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 this um, spots I feel like it's it reflects the the whole bedroom and it brings in so much light because it's next to the window so like I feel like this is the perfect spot for it and I'm going to start by cleaning it um, we didn't manage to clean it yesterday so I'll just uh, go ahead and clean it. I don't have the glass cleaner, so I'm using this kitchen cleaner here. I hope it works. Uh, you see. This mirror was from uh, Santana, Africa. It's a very heavy piece, and I love the quality. I feel like Santana, they really put efforts when it comes to making their furniture. And uh, yeah, I just like it. It's big enough and it's very stable. Once you just uh, lean it to the wall, it's good to go. Oh, oh, oh. 
So next is this uh, part here. Um, I know you guys remember I did the DIY for this uh, whole uh, closet. It used to have brown uh, color, but I just put up um, contact paper and I put this uh, rattan cane to just like um, kind of give the whole area a different look. So I'm going to clean here and I want to do some changes here because if you notice we keep our toothbrushes here and there is normally movement here during the day so I feel like um, I need to take them away. I'm planning to put them uh, somewhere here so you'll see. I'm going to start with the cleaning then uh, the next, next part. I was in the middle of ironing and it just started raining and the sun is out. This is just crazy. Like, can you see? But it smells so good.
places um, were sets that I got uh, thrifted from a uh, home that they got to five. For you guys know, um, I'm the one who be uh, who does the thrifting. So obviously, when I, I come across a nice thing, I I mean it makes sense to just keep it. So I kept that set for myself, and I have this um, set of certain cases also from home that they got to five four. The pair was for seven hundred shillings. Or well, my pillowcases. Uh, my pillows, these two are very huge, they are bigger than the standard size, so for now I'm just squeezing them in, but I'm hoping I can uh, customize a fitting size for this, so for now this is uh, what we are going to work with. So, the tip that I wanted to give you guys, like just make sure your beddings are clean, freshly done, and then uh, I got uh, some linen sprays from this shop here, Shop Malista. I haven't tried them. This is the first time I'm trying them. So I couldn't decide which one to go with. So I bought uh, two fragrances. Uh, they are from Prima Home. I think this is a US company. So she she puts them, I think. Um, this one is clean cotton, um, white lilac and amber. It's supposed to last up to eight weeks. Then there's this one here. This one is pink peony, um, peony rose and, and apple. Okay, let me come closer so that you guys can see them. So these are the two fragrances. Um, well, <laughs> they both smell nice. I can't really decide the, which one to use, but I think I'll go with the clean cotton. Um, I'll I'll save the pink peony for another day so let's see if it has uh, instructions on how to use well it doesn't seem to well it's not to be so I'll just do it freestyle so what I'll do is I'll start with the before I make the bed. I'll start with so I just spray randomly, guys. If you've used this uh, linen sprays before and uh, you know the correct way to use it, please let me know in the comment section so that uh, next time I can uh, do it correctly. But for now, I'll just go in and spray. I don't want to put too much because this is the first time uh, we are trying this uh, this thing and I don't want it to to be too strong because it's almost night time so I think that's enough I'll just go ahead and finish up with making the bed get sheets that are bigger than my bed size. My bed size is the queen, but uh, for the fitted sheet, I normally get uh, the flat sheet, sorry, I normally get a queen, uh, king size, because I feel like uh, it's better to have a sheet that flows like both sides so that um, it doesn't uh, like keep on splitting up. So I'm just going to leave it like that. This is actually a very beautiful sheet. It has some, uh, some what you call this? It's the, it has like a pattern to it. Like it's pleated. Uh, so I'll just leave it like that. Mm -hmm. Sasa, ile joto yuko Nairobi, haitaki duve, so... For now, we use this until 
the weather is is um, back to normal, if I may say. Because no one wants to be <laughs> suffocating under the day at night. So for now, we are just using this. This is also a piece that I thrifted. I like thrifting uh, beddings because I feel like they are affordable and you get uh, unique things. As long as you wash them nicely, I don't see a problem with that. Yeah, so I'll leave it like I'm not an, a professional bed maker. <laughs> There is such a thing. So, yeah, I'll just leave it like that for now. This side uh, it's already cleaned. So, this side is already cleaned. I just like to keep it simple uh, here because it's uh, next to the bed you don't want to heat stuff at night i like to keep uh, this bottle of water here so that you know i can be taking water as i should so the remaining bit is the curtains i'm just going to put them up real quick because it's getting that oh i forgot about this uh, pillow here this is a feather pillow i just like to to have it because sometimes when you are sitting on the bed you need uh, something to support your neck so that's how I'm leaving the bed to look like so let's go and um, put up the curtains and see how it looks so I managed to take down the curtain rods they are very very dusty so let me clean them first then we can put up the curtains So this is going to take a while, so I might as well just be comfortable. Up because I can't reach there, uh, so 
will need some help. So I'll see you guys when everything is put up. So, like I had said, I'm still going to be using this uh, cotton, uh, clean cotton uh, linen spray. I'll spray all the curtains so that uh, the room can be smelling nicely. Last but not least, um, I have my Easter candle here. Just dry. I got this Easter candle from um, Treasured Scents. It smells really nice. So I'm going to light that complement the mood in the room. I also have this uh, diffuser, um, golden uh, spice. Uh, this one I got from a uh, shop Melissa. Um, can't recall how much it was, uh, but it smells really, really nice. It smells so good. I've started using it uh, today and I love how it smells. So that's it guys. I'll just let you like uh, enjoy um, two of the, the whole space. I love it here. It smells so good. It looks so good. I just love the, you know, the minimal look of uh, the bedroom. I don't like a lot of clutter in the bedroom like I mentioned before. So I love how it's looking. I hope you guys love it as well. Let me know in the comment section. Let me know what was your favorite uh, part about this uh, whole uh, cleaning, refreshing uh, video. Let me know if you would want to see more of this, you know. And um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please, 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 please subscribe. I would really appreciate. I'm almost at uh, 1,000 subscribers. And yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And bye-bye. Uh,